What's up guys, Jason Wheeler with Blue Diamond Realty. I'm over here at 8018 Foxfield Springs. This is a four bedroom, four bathroom. Not really a cul-de-sac, but it has that feel because it's down here at the end. This house was built in 2021. There's an elementary school over there. You can kind of hear the kids a little bit. It's just more of a muffled sound. Four bedroom, four bathroom, just shy of 2,400 square feet. You got a paver driveway here. This is a really nice rental, guys. It's 3,100 a month. So it's, you know, relatively speaking, it's, you know, it's higher than some of the other properties you'll find out there in the, you know, $2,500 range, but just really a much nicer grade of a rental property than you'll, most of them that you'll find. I mean, take a look at that door. Big heavy duty door with Schlage hardware with a keypad, which is a nice touch. And then when you come in, you have this long foyer. You've got a, a light, almost like a grayish color um, ceramic tile that's not quite a subway pattern. It's, it's offset just a little bit. And um, carpet's in really good shape. You got some really nice uh, features in here, guys. So. Coming down the foyer here, before you make it into the living room, dining room, you have just a powder room, you know, just your hallway bathroom. With, uh, sorry, not your hallway bathroom, but just your downstairs powder room, bathroom. Kohler sink, nice, really nice black hardware. That's a five panel door that's super cool looking that they've got throughout in here. Under the stairs, you have like a coat closet, but some additional storage that goes back there a little ways. Um, garage is quite large. It's considerably deeper than a standard size garage. If you had a kind of a boat that wasn't too terribly long, but you might be able to fit it in here if you wanted to do something like that. You do have a really nice... Um, Water softener, it looks like a whole house water system there. And if you look right over by the drippers, that black thing right there, that is, um, what do you call that? Like 120 or not sure, 200 volt or whatever that is. Um, I think that's like if you had a Tesla you wanted to charge, I think you plug right into that. So pretty high ceilings out here, lots of nice lighting out here, super, super clean. Again, it's a 2021 build, so it's a relatively newer house, not brand new, but close to new. This carpet looks great. Looks like whoever lived here didn't wear shoes. Not only does it not look soiled or anything, but it's definitely a good quality of carpet, you can tell. So this is just the one bedroom that's downstairs that happens to have its own private bathroom, which is pretty nice. If somebody needed to not use the stairs and be down here and wanted to have a nice, you know, private bathroom with their bedroom attached. That's a fiberglass tub shower combo. Just really nice black hardware. Really nice touches on the shaker cabinet. Um, that countertop is like a two inch thick. Looks like a Corian. It's got a walk-in, I'm sorry, like a, not a walk-in, but just a, the closet's kind of more like a storage closet than like a long wardrobe closet or not quite a walk-in. So this is gonna be like a great room, the way it's set up. You've got really nice shutters throughout. That's a cool ceiling fan. That's very unique. It's a nice, nice fan. They've got a mount there for your TV. You've got this, these things here where you can drop your, your wires down and pop them out down there so you don't have to look at all your cables and your wires. Really nice looking kitchen. White shaker cabinet with all the black hardware. That's a stainless range hood. That's a black Kohler brand undermount sink with some really high-end looking hardware and faucets. Nice uh, Whirlpool dishwasher. That's a Samsung fridge. And we've got Whirlpool in here, so. Um, little bit of a, not too huge, but Pretty nice sized little walk-in pantry. That's a cool little niche right there that you could do something with. Maybe your coffee station. 
Uh, 99%, all this additional cabinetry and countertop space down here was probably a builder upgrade that they did. Again, just a really handsome, uh, uh, what do you call those? Um, gosh, see what I mean? Uh, really nice looking, uh, not blinds, the shutters. Shutters, shutters, shutters. Give you a quick peek at the backyard. So there's not much to it, but it's super clean. It's hardscape. They've got they've got a faux lawn grass here. They've got a paver patio. Obviously, you have this integrated patio cover, and there's some lights in there. It'd be a really nice place to put a picnic table and do some chilling out. Um, tons of space over here. There's a lot you could do with that. This property is up in Centennial Hills, like by the Sky Canyon exit. <clears throat> a little bit of um, debris and stuff trapped down in here. It's just going to need to be blown out and dealt with. But, uh, but yeah, guys, super, super nice property. That's a two inch or maybe even a two and a half inch flat face type bullnose edge that they've got on that island and on the counters throughout. It looks like, uh, not sure what that is. Five inch, five and a half inch flat face baseboard throughout in here. Really nice entry door. These ceilings right here, gosh, that's gotta be 22, 24 feet. Something like that. Really nice stair banister handrail with the white offsetting from the light gray paint really good size loft up here for like an upstairs family room chill room or whatever you wanted to do with it real good size that same ceiling fan all kinds of different lighting in here for different areas and zones so here is one of the upstairs bedrooms. Cool fan. Right here you have this cabinet, which, you know, here's the laundry room right here. So you might want to use that top for folding laundry. Really nice matching set of Samsung front loaders. Those things look like they got shot with car paint. Looks great. A little bit of a shelf up there for detergents and whatever else. So here is your hallway bathroom upstairs. Dual vanity sinks. You've got some uh, drawer set there in the middle. It's a fiberglass tub shower combo. All really nice high-end black hardware. I'm guessing this is all gonna be all Kohler. I'm thinking that's gonna be all color hardware. Not sure. So this one here is probably the smallest bedroom. It's uh, pretty small. This might make a nice little office. There's no ceiling fan, just a cool looking light. Shutters, I mean, everything looks brand new. It almost looks like this house wasn't lived in. And then this is the master bedroom. Look at the view across the valley. If you can see it. I'm not opening the shutters, but yeah, this is up in the Sky Canyon area. The ceilings are got to be 10 foot, roughly. And then this is a pretty cool shower setup here. So you have a nice looking floor. And then what you have is you have a glass panel here in the front, but here's the entry where there's no door. They do have a shower curtain rod right there, which I think is probably not necessary. Um, your controllers for the water are right here. And then you have the wall and then the upper with some lighting up there. And you do have a bench seat down there. So this is what it looks like from backing it up a little bit. Then you have dual sinks, vanity, 
with the drawer set in the middle. Some pretty nice looking lighting. Again, all this really nice hardware. Super nice closet, guys. Super clean. It's not huge, but it's definitely a uh, pretty good size. And then you have your water closet here. That's what's up, guys. 3100 a month for this four bedroom, four bathroom, 2400 square foot house up in the uh, Centennial area, Sky Canyon. Sky Canyon is a newer area. There's a Smith's grocery store that they just built out here um, a few years ago that's newer and services that area, this area. And uh, it's just a nice area. It's out in the Northwest, guys. And actually, if you jump on the freeway and just go a few miles, you hit the uh, exit for Kyle Canyon for going up to Mount Charleston. If you're into that, if you like to ski in the wintertime or snowboard, you're just like literally right there. So that's what's up over here, guys. This is Jason Wheeler with Blue Diamond Realty. This video is a courtesy video hosting. The listing office is actually Black and Cherry Real Estate. Their website is blackandcherryrealestate.com. If you wanted to apply, you would apply online directly on their website. If you have questions, uh, any specific questions, you could reach out to them directly. Um, but yeah, super nice rental, guys. Hit me up if you're interested. Check out my other videos. I've got a bunch of videos on my YouTube channel. If you click on the videos tab, you'll be able to see those. You could also go to my website, which is allvegashousing.com allvegashousing.com where all my videos, all my rentals are embedded on one page and then my houses for sale are embedded on another page. So for easy scrolling that way. Okay guys, thanks for looking. Good luck out there. Good luck with your, uh, with your rental search.